Absolutely not what you wanted in your first game, was it? No, it wasn't. That's football sometimes. I think you have the, the fairy tale where you come back and you, you win the game 2 3 0. Football's never as kind as that. We knew we were coming to a team you know, that had picked up massively with the managerial change. We knew they would be very physical, we knew they would be direct. Um, and I thought they started a little bit better than we did. You know, once we settled into the game, I thought they scored against the run of play. That's um, difficult, they can turn all the lights out. Yeah. 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 Um, we made some change at half time, I thought the reaction was very good. You know, we just couldn't quite find that finish. I think Ruben put one over the bar mm. um, from the six yard box. But yeah, disappointing result. Uh, but we've just said it's important now that you know, we've had 10 days, 14 days off, if you will. Um, we've had a lot change, we're not going to use that as an excuse. The most important thing is now that we, we respond and we must respond for Tuesday. Uh, just spoke to Kieran Brown, he said we were sucker punched twice. The first goal, we were on top when they scored the first goal and we were definitely pushing when they get the second. So, um, lessons to be learned, I guess. Yeah, there are. And I, I think we've had it go our way in certain games so far this season. You know, we've shown we can stand up, Leighton Orient being one. Um, Stevenage another where you know, we can stand up to that direct approach of football, no problem. And I thought we did for large periods of the game, but those small moments, call it luck, you call it whatever, I think the linesman actually flagged for the second goal was offside and then put it back down, so yeah, things sometimes don't go your way, but again, you can't use that as an excuse for, we must make sure that we stay in games and we must make sure again, we regroup now and make sure we get ready for Tuesday. No excuses from Ruben Rodriguez as well, he knows that second, that second red card in the game changed the game. I think I've just said to the players, we've got games coming thick and fast. Tuesday, Saturday, Tuesday, Saturday for the next five weeks. If we want to do what we want this year, which is to be as successful as we can, both in domestic competition in the league, but also in the Cups, we need every single player available, every single game. And that's so important. And uh, the players are under no... Um, yeah, they're, they're aware that we need to... That that's the case. What well, better way to turn that around? You've got Bolton at home on Tuesday, they're the new leaders. What better way to stand up and show what we're really about? That's it, you have to respond. So we're not a team, we're not a group. It's not, I've only had four training sessions with this group in the last week, but they're, they're not a group that strikes me that are going to sit back and solve. You know, I've just said in there, and again, we've got a hungry group of players that want to be successful and have been. And they want to continue that. But to do that, we need to, to respond on Tuesday, and we'll do as much as we can to do that.